Hi guys! I have something really cool to share with you today. I have an unboxing, <laughs> which is very unlike me, but I've had quite an adventure with my camera in the last few months and you may remember in one of my last videos I described how I ended up losing my lens and my filters on one of my trips. I lost the lens, I also lost something else. On the end of my lens was a filter ring, filter holder, and a polarizing filter and I no longer have it. Since that video, I have been going out with my camera and my newfound lens, and I've been enjoying it very much, but I have not had filters to be able to use. After that video came out, I was contacted by Lee Filters, and I received an email that said, hey, we heard that you lost your filters, can we help? And <laughs> I was like, wow, what is this? So I opened the email and I have been in contact with Lee Filters and they would love to have me uh, try out their filter system. Previously, I was using Nisi and I was somewhat happy with it. I did have a few troubles. Uh, as you, if you've been watching my videos for a long time, you may remember but uh, Lee filters are ones that I've always wanted to try and now I'm very, very excited to be able to have this opportunity. Now, I also have fun new things coming up, so I'll have an announcement at the end of this video and um, shall we? Shall we start the unboxing? So it wasn't too long ago that I got a ring at the doorbell and I went out front and there was this huge box. And I was so excited. It says Lee filters all over it. And I opened it up and I wanted to look inside to see what was in there, but I didn't actually go and do any exploring inside. So this is my first time unboxing what is in this box and uh, I wanted to share it with you. So shall we? <laughs> so we have first the Lee 100 Deluxe Kit and I'll give you an overview first. I also have the Sky Filter Set and the adapter rings for my lenses. Now I only have a small number of lenses and so I just need three rings. So they've sent me one for each of my lens sizes and that's all that's in the box. So <laughs> let's open it. So the Lee 100 Deluxe Kit, it contains uh, one Lee holder with additional spares and pouch, a neutral density, graduated medium, graduated hard, graduated medium, these are different strengths, a three filter pouch and wrap, polarizer with case, a Lee big stopper with tin, and a filter wash and filter cloth. So inside the box, first thing that I see right on top here is the filter holder and it's nicely packaged in this awesome, uh, doesn't even feel like just foam, it's really nice. So this would be the piece that the square filters will slide into. And then I do have the filter wash and the polarizer. This is really cool. Look, it's got two zippers. Pretty easy to open. And, oh, it's in its own little beautiful cloth. Nice, it feels very nice. Wow, okay. <laughs> First impressions, this is a bigger filter than Nisi's and it feels a lot more uh, robust maybe. So you can spin it like that and I cannot wait to try this polarizer. I mean, I use a polarizer so often, not only for water reflections or trees, 
in the uh, in the forest but you know just for so many sunsets sunrises there's so many uses for a good polarizer so that is and it's this little uh, chamois is actually sewed up so it's like got its own nice little pouch so I like this uh, I like this case because it feels very, very protective. And when I'm out <laughs> doing my hiking and other misadventures, I need something that's going to protect this. So one's a big plus. Oh, okay, so now we have this, the leaf filters case. Nice. Oh no, these are the, uh, so it's a case, and these are the graduated filters that were listed on the outside. Nicely wrapped once again. And, okay, so I open it up in threes, and it's a pouch, so it's going to open this way. And there are the filters inside. I'm being super careful with them. You ever have that when you get something new and you're just so super careful, especially for the first little while? Okay, so we have the Lee 0.6 neutral density medium graduated filter. Lee filters made in England. And, and there it is. See that? got a nice soft graduation there this is gonna be really really cool and it's written right at the top so Lee 0.6 ND medium so that you know which filter is which I like that all right let's see what the other two are So 0.9, you can see that's darker. That's awesome. This one is a hard grad, not a medium grad. So that means that the transition between this top and the bottom is a lot harder, which is awesome because if you have a really uh, straight and defined horizon like water over the uh, sky and then water a hard graduated filter is going to help you to control the light intensities between the two areas a lot better than a soft graduated one and then we have the V 1.2 and this one is a medium so <laughs> Those are the three grads that the deluxe kit comes with. Now, we have a very special filter here <laughs> that comes in its very own metal case, and that is the Lee Big Stopper. Okay, so we have it nicely packaged again with foam at the top and the bottom. And this one is square. The other ones are rectangles because they are graduated. So when you slide them into your holder, you can adjust how far you want the filter to go because you have a horizon. But with the solid neutral density filter, you don't need to do that. That is fantastic, a 10 stop neutral density filter. Now this will really help me to get smooth water and uh, yeah, anything that I need a long exposure for. I am very excited to try this. Underneath the filter holder, there is a spot that says Lee 100 instructions and parts. And in here I have a filter holder pouch. Very, very nice. A filter cloth. Really nice. Filter guides. 
and I'm sure I will read about these as I look at how to assemble this onto my lenses. The Lee 100 system instructions and ooh, an exposure guide. That's very cool. And the stopper range long exposure filters, Lee filters. Awesome. This is really good. And what I love is that this is very simple, right? So I'm not going to have to carry a big, thick instruction manual everywhere I go just to know what I'm doing. That's really important to me. So that's what's in this box, the deluxe kit. And I mean, already I'm just feeling so spoiled. This is going to be fantastic to have these kind of filters to be available for my work is wonderful. I've always just had, you know, a polarizer and uh, one filter, maybe two, because they're, you know, I really wanted to get a decent quality filter and, um, well, now I have a whole set. So thank you so much, Lee. This is so kind of you. And I'm, I'm so touched by your generosity and I can't wait to, uh, to try out your products. And let's not forget, I have the filter sky set and I love creative filters. I love being creative when I'm out. I don't always like to follow the rules. I like to try new things. And so this one, uh, in our discussions was a, uh, a request of mine <laughs> and uh, it includes a, a sunset a sky blue and a coral stripe filter so I have never ever tried one of these before and I love trying new things this is going to be very very exciting let me show you what they look like so <laughs> I'm going to open that up oh all right this is the sunset filter Wow, that is really neat. <laughs> a sunset filter. So it's going from like red to yellow to almost clear at the bottom. And I'm guessing that this is going to enhance the colors in the sunset. I don't think that this is cheating. Creative photography, I mean, the whole act of photography is creative. And so whatever tools, whatever paint brushes you want to use in, on your canvas, go for it. And so I'm very, very excited to try this. In fact, I'm just holding it out the window here and it looks really, really pretty. <laughs> looks really interesting. I can't wait. Here, look at, see how I look? <laughs> so that is Lee Sunset 2. Okay. Next. Sky Blue. <laughs> Amazing. That'll just make the sky pop whenever you need that extra blue, I think. Oh, I can't wait to try that. <laughs> Sky blue. It's a very uh, natural looking blue. I like that. That's that's really beautiful. Oh. Coral stripe filter. So can you see it is clear except for a coral stripe. Now you may be thinking, that's strange. Why would I ever use that? But to be honest, I have created this effect in Photoshop many, many times when I will I have a landscape and I just feel like that area near the horizon where the sun is, maybe it's setting or rising, that just needs that little bit of uh, color filter. I have applied a filter in Photoshop and then just uh, selectively used it across the horizon line. So I actually think that this is going to be a really interesting filter and something really helpful. So these um, filter rings, I'll show you one of them. These are basically step up type rings for uh, that you put this onto your lens and then 
the adapter allows the filter system to fit onto the end. The filter system is sufficiently big to big enough to cover the entire area of the end of the lens, which is really, really important. <clears throat> so I have a 77, a 55, and a 62. Let me just show you the difference between the 77 and the 55. So here they are. The 77 is this one. So if I have uh, my 77 millimeter lens on, and that's millimeter meaning the size of the actual uh, lens filter, then I'm going to use this one. But if I have a smaller lens filter opening, 55 millimeters, I'm going to use this one. But the outside ring is the same size because that's the size of the filter holder. So, <laughs> so that's the great thing about these kind of filters. You don't need to buy several filters to fit different lenses. You have an adapter system and you can use the same filters on each of your lenses. And it just makes it so convenient. And not only that, you don't have to spend tons and tons of money out of pocket buying different size filters. So that's the brilliance of a Squares filter system. So obviously I'm going to take these things out of here, out of this box, and I'm going to put them into my backpack. They look to me like they're going to fit into the section that I have reserved for filters in my Loa Pro Protactic bag. I have the uh, 450 AW, and uh, AW means all weather. I love that bag. I am sort of shopping though for another because I want to get into some longer hiking once the uh, spring weather comes. And so I'm looking to lighten my load in a whole bunch of different ways and the backpack may be one of them. We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> Excellent. So again, thank you, Lee. I will be so excited to try this out. As soon as I am able to get out, our stay at home order is still in effect, but it will be hopefully shortly <laughs> that I'll be out. And I do still have that announcement that I was telling you about. I'm so excited to let you know that I have started a second channel with my father. This is a project that we are working on together and my father is a musician. He has been a musician all his life. So what I mean by that is he's been a programmer, computer programmer, an accountant, and all sorts of things. He's a really smart guy, but his passion has always been music. And so ever since he was very, very young, he picked up a violin, a piano, and he just really wanted to learn music. And so he's been playing things all his life and uh, we have decided to start a channel that combines uh, my video and creative visuals with his music. And what we want to do is to bring you just really relaxing and enjoyable, uplifting videos that are music and just something you could put on as background noise or dinner music or uh, sleeping. just to to bring some positivity and to jo some joy to your life right now i know we've all had lots of stress but there's so much beauty and there's so many good things to look forward to and to enjoy and so we really hope that this will be one of the things that you will enjoy and this is my father's first venture and first uh time putting himself out there really on uh in this sort of way on YouTube. And so I really hope that you will stop by. It's called Relaxing Interludes. And I hope that you'll stop by and that you'll subscribe. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, I would love it if you would do so too. We have lots of adventures coming up and uh, hiking and still my film camera is waiting for me. And all of your film images, I still am going to share them. Uh, don't think that I've forgotten because I haven't. 
and uh, yeah. So <laughs> thanks for coming along, guys. We have so much to, uh, to do and to talk about. I hope that you're doing well, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye. <laughs>